Here goes Mashash. Alzadi. Zinedine Mashash creates the angle. Can't hit the target. Pretty straightforward too for victory to get through Massage. That opening towards goal, a bit of a concern there for Carl Viet. Looking to run it, Roderick Miranda. And he's found the angle for the cross and Izzo was struggling and victory needs Damien De Silva to hook the ball to safety. And Arzani to deliver this corner, the outswinger, plenty of height to it. Roderick Miranda off the post. With Joe Gauchy beaten as close as we've come. Well, Miranda's a handful, he's tall, he doesn't get contact with the head, but it was still goal-bound, had Gauchi beaten. Clough, change of angle didn't really work, still might do though. Kito has a go, not far away from the Reds' captain. Yeah, great anticipation and, and purpose from Ryan Kito there. Victory defended the corner well, numbers to confronting the ball, but... Ryan Teague beaten by the anticipation of Kitto. Chapman. On the run into the channel from Mashash is rewarded. It's Zinedine Mashash and Bruno Forderoli. Mashash again, can they dig it out? Hazani, what a save by Gauci. That's an outstanding stop. That's good football. That's desperate defending. The victory finally gets someone in front of goal with a good chance. And Tarzani, look at this scramble. And Tarzani can't quite get the contact he requires. Puts his team right back under the pump. Tarzani and Fornaroli. A little farewell present as he heads off to the Asian Cup with the Socceroos from Bruno Forderoli, a bullet header. Oh, I think it's going to, well, it's been a judged offside. The AR will do the rule, it's an incredible header. You can't take your eyes off Adelaide for a second, not with the players on field for them, but in these moments, victory have looked more convincing. Good challenge by Brimmer to win the ball back for victory. Down goes Forderoli, free kick. This one is well within range for Jake Brimmer. There we go, the stats have him level with Aaron Boy. Brimmer! Well, by the look of Joe Gauci, he was confident that that was always going well wide. Yeah, well, on the Harvey Norman replay, Jake wasn't so convinced. He does hit the ball beautifully. Well, all around us, the victory fans on their feet, perhaps recognising that their team need their help to get over the line against a very stubborn, resilient opponent. Handball against Zach Clough. The game easily could go either way. What the victory have had the better of the second half, I think, but in a blink, uh, Adelaide have played well enough to keep them worried. There's lots of little things going on off the ball as well. Volupale darts into the box. Machet! Deadlock broken! Zidu! The cult hero! A Melbourne victory for Antonomi Park. And finally, Tony Popovich's team, a breach, a stubborn Reds defence. Well, the handball free kick against Zach Clark was taken quickly, and then the Harvey Norman replay just tells a beautiful tale of the Maisie run of Mission Valupola. His second half has been very impressive. Look at him go, cutting a swathe through the Adelaide defence, and then... It's the magical Moroccan from the penalty spot or thereabouts, hooking it in with his left foot, giving Victory the lead. It's a stunning goal. Fantastic work, Victory. And now it's for Adelaide to find an answer. Good football by Victory. Falami. Cross steered away for now by Tunnicliffe. Brimmer encouraged to shoot. Balupale might. Good save. Joe Gatchi with the outstretched left boot to keep Adelaide in the contest. Tied it up by De Silva. Ian Miranda, a really good central defensive carry for Tony Popovich. Falami on the move. Out in front of Fornaroli. 
As Adams alongside, wants to go on himself, and he's got it. Bruno Fornaroli had one ruled out in the first half for offside. That one's going to stand. Big smile for Tony Popovich. They're going to miss him. Goal number 13 of the season. But one to remember right on the 90 minute mark before he heads off to the Asian Cup. And victory have the points in the back. Well, on the Harvey Norman replay before, we just sit in awe of Bruno Fornaroli. Admire the work of Ben Falami bursting through midfield to set El Tuna away. And this guy is just incredible. Just an incredible finish. It's so difficult, which he makes look routine.